Good morning, guys. It's another day at home, but not for Casey. He just got back home from grocery shopping with his parents, and he also went to Home Depot because we couldn't fully finish mounting the TV stuff, so he had to go get some stuff. And then also, Papa Chan is going to be installing an outlet for our bidet in our master bathroom. But look at this, look at the score. It's a madhouse out there. While they were gone, I, I was cleaning up, I did some dishes, made some coffee, but yes. Oh, that is for this thing. That's for the knives? Nice. So you put it together? And then the knives go in, inside the slots. Oh. So inside these slots. But then they all go in here. We just oh, haven't set it up yet. Oh. So how was it out there for you? Normal. <laughs> I don't see any difference. People got panic. I don't know why. Yeah. To be honest with you, I had no idea. Well, that's good. Casey, have you washed your hands? I just washed my hands over here. Perfect. Everyone washing ah. hands, nice and responsible. What happened? These are the pictures we have. Yeah. Uh, or these the and then I, come I need a too. real big one. All right, what's up, guys? Just finished cooking, and not the first time I, uh, I cooked in this house. I, I kind of missed out on... Uh, documenting the first time? Yeah, missed out on documenting the first time cooking yeah. here. But then you kind of didn't want to count it because it was just pasta and sauce. Yeah. out of the jar so you were like it's not real cooking because i'm not chopping anything true well then technically then i'm not really cooking today either because we got this uh, korean barbecue um pre-marinated thing from a korean grocery store so i guess i didn't really cook today either then that's why i said it counted last time too but you were the one saying it oh today. right okay true true but yeah this is what i came up with and he's already done eating. He's gone, done. That's yeah, good. Gone. Mm. Yeah, well, my dad's on the construction worker time schedule right now. It's his lunch break. He only has 15 minutes. He's got to get back to work. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so this is our first surgical surgery for the house. My dad's put some, uh, put a hole in the wall already. Actually, yesterday was the first one. When we were hungry. Oh, true, true, true. Yeah, the first one. Oh, this, is, this one's a real surgery. That was like a little patch-up job. This one's... So what are you doing right now for us? So we're gonna run the electrical wire all mm -hmm. the way around this door frame, mm -hmm. all the way to the bathroom behind us. So mm -hmm. the right, there, our toilet's like right through this wall. And what we're doing is we're trying to have an outlet inside the bathroom uh, where the toilet is so that we could have uh, an outlet to plug our bidet in. Cause right now we're just running a wire. That's what we're plugging the bidet into, which is running into here. So now we're just gonna power from here and bring it all the way to the bidet. Okay, so this is the trick right here. How'd you learn all this stuff? I'm in service. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. That, that means your son has zero common sense. Probably. <laughs> so now I'm gonna use this to tape this together. Tape this really tight. My goal is to put this thing through and I'm gonna hook this wire back out. Oh, I see. Oh, that's why you needed the string. Mm -hmm. You're fishing for the hooks. I'm fishing for the hook. So, stick it down there. And hopefully I can feel it. I hope that steak... Ah, maybe I need some light, actually. Oh, don't move, don't move, don't move, don't move. Stay there. Trying to stay still. So, we're going to paint this. So I'm gonna fit this in. I hope I can actually... All right, so while the guys are doing that with the electrical stuff, I wanted to document this momentous occasion where I finally get to do the first load of laundry and I only have enough detergent for one load because I ordered more detergent and it's coming in tomorrow. But till then, there's a lot of laundry. Look how cute this hamper that I got. I've been waiting for this moment. So check this out, it actually has wheels. So I can just wheel it on over right across the hall. Oh, it's like a hotel. Oh, this is in the way. Oh, hotel construction. I know. Hotel laundry, <laughs> hotel cleaning service. <laughs> but yay, look at this. I'm so happy. And then, boom, here's the laundry room. Oh man, this, uh, this is kind of sad how this gets me uber excited look at this oh it's so smooth i love it <sighs> i don't know am i am i weird am i really weird and i'm really 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 excited to do my first load in the new house look at this and then did i show you guys already i don't know if i did but the doors open away from each other 
I don't know what kind of pipe it is. Really, it's plastic pipe actually. Oh, I think it's... I'm glad I didn't punch through the pipe. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah, that was close. This is for the um... AC? The yeah, yeah, yeah. It's the AC thingy. He, Steve was telling me about that. That's mm. the thing that keeps dripping. I keep hearing dripping. Oh, really? He was saying... <laughs> I'm assuming it's that. <laughs> oh, yeah. Maybe you can move a little more that way. No, there's a there's a st uh, stud right here. You can't exactly fit the box for the electrical in, so we're gonna try and just wedge it in there. We're gonna make the hole a little bit bigger and try to push it up against this stud on this side and, and, and away from the pipe on the other side and see if we can just wedge it in between. We'll see what happens. See, that's the stud. There's the pipe. Meanwhile, in the laundry room, the washer is done and now it's time to move over to the dryer. Exciting stuff, guys. We are abandoning that previous thought of trying to wedge it in there. We are going to uh, not put the electrical next to that pipe because we just don't want to crack that pipe. Feels kind of scary. We don't know what that pipe's for either, so we're gonna make another hole, another square, and uh, hopefully this one checks out. We've we kind of dug our the drill in, and it checks out and goes all the way through. So here we go. All right, this is some real homeowner type stuff. This is the type of stuff that my dad's always warned me about. Like, you gotta learn this stuff. You gotta learn to change your own light bulbs. You gotta, <laughs> you gotta learn to not rely on calling a plumber or a fix your own toilet. I don't know why, my dad's always been able to like do this stuff around the house growing up and I've watched him do it a lot of times and I've assisted many times, just like I am right now, but and I've never gravitated towards this stuff. But now that I am a homeowner myself, I, I'm i looking and watching and studying and learning, taking notes in a different kind of, through a different kind of lens. It's a lot though, it's a little overwhelming. Beautiful, Tiff. What do you think? <gasps> Ooh, nice. But I had to nail the hole. Yeah. Yeah, big old hole next door. Maybe we can just use like a glue gun and then, just kidding. <laughs> just glue it. That'd be cool. But now I have to go down and... You gotta connect that same side. Hey, my dad's a lot more handier than I thought he was. I knew he you was handy. You credit. He's never, I've never you know seen him do was, electrical things before. He was an engineer, dude. I know he was an engineer. A literal engineer. But like he did like a lot of wood like work growing up. Like I seen him like cut wood and hammer things together, build shelves. Huge shelves that were like really extravagant and like had nice molding and stuff. And then he like dug a pond in our backyard and had like a whole like plumbing thing. You don't think he needed thing. electrical for that? True. I don't know, I don't know why it just, Oh, there goes the, the electric. You do a blog like this. <laughs> Imagine. But yeah, that's kind of awesome. I was going to ask you, did you learn? I learned a lot. Dad? I did learn a lot. Because you were telling me earlier that when you were younger, your dad was trying to teach you things and that the whole time you're just like, yeah, yeah, I don't care, I don't care. But now that you're a man of the house and yep. you have your own house, did you soak anything? Yeah, I'm watching him through different a, di a different set of lenses. Good job, Bubba. Thank you. Oh, you bought one of those thingies? Yeah, he brought cool. it from home. What? He came with the intention of doing this. That's it was so cool. Yeah. Thank you, Baba. Right, no electricity. Where is the uh, scissors? Where'd they go? Oh, they're over there. See, I'm helping. Yep. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Thanks, helper. Helping the helper. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the assistant to the assistant. <laughs> yeah. Regional manager. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> 
Oh, no, no, no. I actually have wire cutters. You do? Yes. All right. Instead of it. messing up the scissors, let me go get the thingy mababa. What are you guys doing? These poses are infinite. Oh, yoga. This is awesome. Are you doing something? I, can, I cannot do this one. Please do this. I can do this one. Child's pose or bend your elbow. Calm down. Hold your hips. This is what you do during the quarantine. That's the favorite. Yes. Yoga at home. Now can we have one yoga mat? Oh, I didn't even notice that it's the same color. That's funny. Ow, that does hurt. to have dinner. Look at this. Mama, what'd you make? I made uh, skin fish, tilapia, um, sweet chilies, Ooh. sauce shrimp, chicken heart with salary, and uh, Casey made that beef and uh, broccoli. Ooh, this looks so pretty. Papaya, chicken feet, soup. soup. Oh, that sounds uh, appetizing. Yeah, you have <laughs> that before with the snow oh, yeah. here, pumpkin. I don't remember. Yeah, you had it. It smelled pretty good house. though. Yeah. Oh, okay. And then Diana made some drinks. What's it look like? We're ready to feast. We have a little bit of Jan. I'm using Tancred. This is what you guys had. And a little bit of St. Germain, which is an elder flower liqueur. It's really floral. It's really nice with Jan. Ooh. A tiny bit of sugar and some cucumber. Really refreshing. Ooh, some cucumber. It smells really good in here. I'm looking really hungry, so. I know, girl. I'm hungry too. Let's eat. All right, it is March something, something, something. Tomorrow is March 17th, right? At St. Patrick's Day? Yeah, so today March 16th. Yeah, something, and something, something. <laughs> and we are drinking some proper Irish whiskey. Proper 12. All right, Connor McGregor, here's to you. I'm probably just gonna take a sip. Uh, should we take a shot? Are you driving? Probably. Are know. you the only driver? <laughs> Mm. It's not that bad. It's not bad.